Baraba! Andrea Davenport, social influencer, future disruptor, Brighton Middle School's official goodwill ambassador. <laughs> it's a lot of things in one, I know. I'd be honored if you'd join me on stage this afternoon at the new school year assembly. Wow, thanks. That would be incredible, Andrea. <gasps> <gasps> well, what's this? <laughs> it's actually Andrea. Isn't that what I said? No, you said Andrea. Oh, I I'm, I'm so, so sorry. Oh, honey, it's fine. It's your first day. Forgive and forget. Wow, thank you, Andrea. That's really nice of you. Oh, crud, it, is it Andrea? Or, wait, what was it again? Is it, which vowel? Is it E? A, 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 E, I, O, 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 Andrea? Or is there an umlaut? Is it like an Andrea? Or did, <laughs> maybe, maybe you should take a seat before you make this even worse. Judge a book by the cover Time you try kombucha <clears throat> You might think it's gross Well, I'm just like that kombucha Take it Take a second chance on me Making hunker cheese I'm a vital part of your charcuterie Second chance on me You got inspirational in a bathroom. Oh, yeah. It's my superpower. I can do it anywhere. I did it at a funeral once. You are the most frustrating. <laughs> Whoops. Reflex. Oh, no, 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 no. Wake up, Andrea. Andrea. Oh, whatever. Help me get her in that cart. Ah, disposing of the body. Great plan. What? No. I I've got to get her to the nurse's office. That lady has nothing but band-aids. <laughs> Wait a minute. I have no idea where the nurse's office is. Ooh, <laughs> 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 ah, what an elegant bouquet of emotional and physical floundering. Ah, youth. <laughs> no, I, I, I can fix this. I just have to get Andrea. Andrea. Not now. I have to get her to the nurse's office before anyone notices. Great idea. And I'm going to raise this curtain for no particular reason. <gasps> it's Molly McGee. What's she doing with Andrea? It's, uh, not what it looks like. Bye-bye, <laughs> Molly McGee. Seriously, who does she think she is? She's the worst of the worst. The worst of the worst. Oh, no. No, come on. It's just feeling I've won. You won. It's over. Molly McGee is as good as packed and yet. Ah, I can't believe I'm going to do this. Please, when you hear the story of what really happened, you can think I'm crazy. I'm going to need a plan B. Give me that applause already. What I gotta do? Yay! Scratch? Okay, thank you. Where to start? First, I'm over the whole Andrea Andrea thing. I mean, believe me when I say life is too short. You can call me Andrea, 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 whatever. I say go nuts with it. Let's get creative. Now, I'd like to bring it down a little bit, get a little serious. Because there's a girl out there having a really rough day. And I think in some small way... That's my fault. She doesn't deserve to be treated like the worst of the worst. No one does. So please, on my behalf, give a big, bright middle school cheer for... Libby! She's okay now! I decree it! Yes! Also, Molly McGee isn't so bad either. Cut her some slack, you animals. We love you, Andrea! 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 What happened here? Andrea! The rest of us, we're still terrible. Very terrible. Awful. I'm here just because I like the uniforms. Andreas, warm ones are blowing this spring. That's why I stay cool with. Whoa! Someone call the police. There's a fashion crime in progress. 
<laughs> We're making a ghost movie, Andrea. Shut up! Uh, I love horror movies! Totally unrelated, did you know that I'm a professional actress? See? Um, I, we all know where this is going, right? For the best in clothing, beauty, and sports, spend your money at Davenport's. She wants to star in our movie. I just had a crazy thought. Andrea Davenport in our movie? <gasps> Molly McGee, you read my mind! Oof. Meet at the store warehouse tomorrow morning. It's where we shoot our commercials, so we've got all the sets and equipment we need. What? We're gonna make the best movie ever. Okay, love you, bye! <laughs> About to shoot my very first feature, thanks to all my followers for believing in me. This is for you, Thundras! Uh, uh, Andrea? I said, action, you know. Maybe I shouldn't have taken this shortcut through the scary woods. Kill the ghost! Line? Boo. Right. Boo! Oh no! The hitchhiker's ghost is coming to eat my soul! Goodness, I'm wearing Swedish memory foam running shoes. Available now at Davenport's department store. Okay, that's a cut. Oh, God, that was my best stuff. That was great, Andrea. Um, but how about we stick to the script? Sorry, I just knew it was the natural spot for product placement. Okay, I hear you, but um, maybe we we don't do product placement. I mean, you're the director, but it is how we're paying for everything. Oh. Like this portable waffle iron for that on-the-go breakfast lover hard pressed for time. I got one of those. Oh, I got this. Gerard! Gerard does all our commercials. He can work the camera and he knows my good side. <laughs> Spoiler, it's both. <laughs> You're replacing me? She can't do that! Well, you can still do the behind the scenes footage. Can't wait to capture how this all falls apart! Oh, I know it hurts to fire family, but like my daddy says, it gets easier every time. What? What's important is we do whatever it takes to realize my vision. You mean my vision. Yeah, that's what I said, my vision. All right, Gerard, ready for my close-up. Look, Andrea, we need to talk about... One second. Libs! Yeah, coming! Um, did you read my latest script? I addressed all your notes. And I super appreciate you staying up all night, but we decided to go in a bold new direction. Ghost romance. Gomance. But that's not even scary. I mean, do ghosts have to be scary? Why can't they be cute and cuddly? Because ghosts aren't cuddly. They're sick and twisted and sometimes a little gassy, especially after eating old craft services. Molly, do something. Okay. She's ruining our movie. Oh, uh, Andrea, the whole point was to make a horror movie. Yes. The horror comes from the ghost spending an eternity having never found true love. I'm the director. It's still our movie. Molly, I'd like you to meet family friend, visionary director, Greta Gerwig. Hi, I'm Greta Gerwig. With Greta Gerwig attached, we'll have no problem getting international distribution. Okay? Well, Libby can have sad turtles or friends at her party, but she can't have both. Follow me, Fundrias. There's a quinceanera down the street. Must oh, dance. dance. Must dance. Must find a and dance. Wanna dance. dance. I'm not even touching the door. <sighs> oh! <laughs> Show, aka another chance to 
share my incredible gifts with you, my devoted Pondrias. You should listen to her daddy. Andrea? You agree with me? I was gonna be this year's snowflake queen. Like mom was at my age, but without the celebration, that can't happen. Oh, Button, you can pick any crown you want from our Halloween surplus. We'll just stage a photo and put it on your socials. It'll be fun. Or is this actually happening? She looks, she looks just like her mother. I don't understand. Happy Volunteer Week, Fundras! Be like me and give Mother Nature a perfectly manicured hand by recycling. <laughs> recycling is the first step to saving the Earth. It's hard work, but someone had to do it. Mm, I love you. Bye! I love what you've done here, Andrea. Local do-gooder proves anything is possible. I don't mind getting a little dirty to help our furry friends. <laughs> okay, that's enough. I'm here with hometown do-gooder, Andrea Davenport. How does it feel to be volunteer of the week of volunteer week? They named her what? Get off, get off. Volunteer of the week of volunteer week? Oh, wow. I'm just doing my part to unhappify Brighton. <laughs> That's just a silly little word I came up with and trademarked. What? Unhappify is my word! Yes! It is your word, Molly. And Fraudria just used your word on the hyperlocal news for the whole world to see! <laughs> Molly volunteers for the right reasons. Helping others. Right. You don't need to be on TV. Hey, look! Molly's on TV! <laughs> Molly, so great of you to help you, cutie. You'll sell nougat. I'll sell more nougat. We'll earn enough for that marquee in no time. May the best do-gooder win. I'm giving my all to win this. I won't let no one steal the show. I'm working my Off. Hey, Fondrias! Check it out! All my hard work selling nougat paid off. Everybody's here for the unveiling. Even my parents! Congratulations, Andrea! You must have worked so hard to sell all that candy. I guess I'm just a born salesman like my parents. Right, Daddy? <laughs> Hold that hug for the cameras button. We'll get more likes if it feels real. Oh no. Oh, I've made a horrible mistake. Marjorie wasn't trying to steal my credit. She was just trying to get her parents' attention. Oof. That is sad. Honestly, I almost feel bad for her. And you know me. I have very little empathy for others. Scratch, what have I done? I let my jealousy get in the way of charity. I'm the do-gooder. That still doesn't work. The winner of the Tournament of Nougat in our hearts is... You got before he releases those pictures, please! Do I have time for an I told you so? No! You can say it twice later! Andrea Davenport! Whew! Daryl, I thought
thought I wasn't going to stop you in time from releasing those photos. Photos? I was ordering a burrito. Photos are already up. <gasps> That's one for the whoops column. What is the meaning of all this excess nougat? Uh, um, so this is all of the nougat Andrea sold in her garage because she sold it all to herself. What are you doing? I can explain everything. You see, Andrea wanted to make sure we got the new marquee and that no one had to eat nougat because nougat uh, uh, terrible for your teeth. So she knew that everyone eating that much nougat would give everyone cavities and wanted to protect Brighton's overworked dentistry community. So without further ado, I give you the volunteer of the week of volunteer week, Andrea Davenport. <laughs> Thank you.